Oh! I think he's got it. He's got it. What's up, y'all? It's Weston Smith. And fishing with Becca. And today we're about to crush it doing a speed fishing challenge hitting like 10 plus ponds in the Florida. Wait. In the Florida heat. In the, in the Florida heat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, y'all, uh, Becca's playing it safe. She's starting off smart with the Sanko. I'm going straight for the swim bait. I'm going to try and cover some water, throw something moving, see what hits. By the way, this is crystal clear. Wow. I'm thinking first cast. Okay, I was wrong about the first cast. Oh, almost had him. Something small was chasing. I don't think that was a bass. That was definitely felt like a bluegill. This is the beauty about Florida. You walk across the street and you're at a different pond. I don't really know what all their like smaller species are out here. I'll catch a tilapia. I don't think I've had one of those in a while, except from like Costco. Might be all about the drop shot. Ooh, I hit the bank over there. That cast is deserving of a bite. Yeah, I think they're definitely tilapia. By the way, we're in the rental BMW. <laughs> so, no in case y'all were wondering, what, what vehicle did y'all take to Texas? I thought it was the truck. Well, it is, and it was, but now yeah, we're in the. It just felt fancy, you know? Now we're in Devin's dad's rental. That YouTube paycheck hit, and we're like, mm. Yep. Oh. I think we'll hit 10 ponds in 30 minutes. Uh, yeah, light work. I think there's only one neighbor who's gonna call the police on us. Yeah, it doesn't look private. We actually found a public pond. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we probably better give this one five minutes. I think these are all five minute pawns. Did you get bit? Yeah. I was setting up to swing on that one. That actually felt good. Yeah, first bite right there along that bank on the other side. Did you get any bites? No. I think between what we're both throwing, should have at least had a fish. Let's make a move. On to the next. Is this the third pond or the fourth pond? This is the fourth pond. Uh, yeah, because because we hit yeah. two at this first one. Oh, yeah, Alright, so <laughs> Becca and I just rolled up to the fourth pond. We're gonna see what's up with this. It's the only one that hasn't had no fishing signs. There's little fishies. That's good. Uh, oh, this might be the one. I had a bite too. I found the brush pile. Got him. First one. <laughs> First largemouth in Florida. And he's about to go back in the water. No, ow, no. Calm down. <laughs> First Florida largey boys <laughs> of the trip. Hit the saucy swimmer. That's how we do it. Four ponds in 20 minutes. <laughs> See ya. He kind of sliced me too. Woo. Had to get that land and that first look for y'all though. Saucy swimmer with the underspin. Yes. Please, and thank you. Sick, there's bass in here. We're on to something. Is this where we do some research there's on some intel? so many ponds. All right, we're looking for pond number five. All right, let's put five minutes on the clock and see how many bass we can catch. Oh, oh, this is, I just got him. no way. Okay, Becca's talking about getting hit at this spot right off the bat. Basically every pond in Florida has a private property, no trespassing sign. So we're just getting in and out of these things. Oh, froggy grass too. Top water would probably smoke them. Hit this drain real quick. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you're getting so unlucky. Oh, and it was both. It was like all of the above. It was swimming at you and it was small. <laughs> Your rod was like not bending. <laughs> I didn't think you had a fish on. I'm like, she must be joking. <laughs> Becca just had that one fish and she's like, it's either swimming at me or it's really small and her rod tip like was barely bent. I'm like, I don't know if she has a fish. <laughs> nope, she did. <laughs> can't seal the deal on these Florida pond. Oh, oh, I just had one too. And I'm talking about how she can't seal the deal. I literally just had one eat. Oh my gosh. All right, we both suck. Nice. Five ponds later. Becca is on. Sometimes it be like that. Aren't these Florida fish supposed to be on fire? I thought these Florida bass were supposed to be like crazy aggressive. That's what they said. Florida strain. Everyone wants the Florida strain bass in their ponds. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, give me some Florida quarter pounders, please. What is going on? All right, I think it's time to take the beamer to pond six. One to one on the catches. Well, we got five minutes starting now <laughs> until security gets here. Oh. I think he's got it. He's got it. He's got it. It was like a 
like a top water hit. <laughs> no time to talk, man. No time to talk. It's two and one. I'm up. We got like five minutes here because it says no fishing just like every other place. And I landed like on his head. It wouldn't have mattered. It would not have mattered what bait you were using. Like if you weren't using a Guggen bait, you would have still caught that fish. You, you know what I'm saying? This place is on. Fish number three. Oh, no, he came up. My gosh, Becca's on her first one. She's throwing a bandito bug. Guggen baits rock in the house. Ooh, by the way, Carl's Bait and Tackle, where you can grab all these goodies, is having their biggest sale of the year. It started on the 2nd of November, so go ahead. Oh my god, I just got smashed. Go get you guys some savings on the baits, man. Now is the time. If you need any more tackle, hit them up. Rods, reels, baits, apparel, you name it. Wow, what a hook set. Becca's on with two already. Oh my gosh, smoked him. All the bass we've caught equal two pounds. <laughs> Did you say that might be pushing it? <laughs> okay, Becca's got it going on. A Texas rig seems to be outperforming the saucy swimmer at this moment. The moving baits might not be the juice, but we're on the hunt for something over a pound. I didn't know they made bass this small in Florida. Travel to Florida to hit its world-renowned private stocked ponds. <laughs> all right, here we go. All the way. Oh my, I literally hit the bank. If I don't get a fish on this cast, no bass on that side of the pond has seen a bait yet. And I don't have a fish yet. Oh, I literally thought he was going to go flying into the street. Oh my God. <laughs> At least they're aggressive. <laughs> Becca's got me smoked now. She's literally at like five fish, I think. Okay, like three casts over here, and then I think we got to go. All right, I'm making my way to pond number seven, seeing if there's some bigs. This one's definitely a giant body of water. All right, maybe we should head to pond number eight. <laughs> I think the, the mission in this video is now to fish ten ponds. <laughs> if we can make it happen. Ten ponds, then dinner at like five o'clock, because this place is whack. All right, y'all, we just pulled up to pond number eight. Got the saucy swimmer out of the trunk, ready to rock and roll. I feel like this John Deere is running. I don't know. I don't know if it's very basilicious. Homie in the truck seems to be eyeballing us. Oh, oh, I just got hit. Did you see that swirl? Yeah. That was big time. Fishing, huh? Yeah. Dude, this that is not a bass. That looks big. This is not a bass. Oh my God. What is that? Oh God, <laughs> what is in the water here? You said you had pliers, right? So some type of fish is attacking the saucy swimmer and it is not a bass at all. And it's got a big wake, a big swirl, and it's biting and letting go. And we're definitely getting eyeballed by a truck. This place does not say no fishing, but it does say that the area is closed. So it's a toss up. Oh, he hit it again. Yeah, it's definitely a freak of nature. It's a big fish. I honestly think it's the flash of the blade. I don't think it's the bait. Uh, the truck seems to not be there anymore. Okay, well, this has been fun. Definitely a crazy mystery species at pond number eight, but we are trying to make it to 10, so that means we've got two more bodies of water to hit real fast, and there ain't no bass hitting us, so dust. Woo. I'm sorry. Yes, sir. Okay. Number nine, fail. I don't know what the flying fish species is that though. That could have been freshwater tarpon. Freshwater tarpon? Yep, that was a fish. Oh my gosh. Literally there is flying fish out there. What? Is this a joke? What is in Florida waters, y'all? Okay, that guy was clearly a fisherman and he's trying to keep the good spots to himself. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, that was actually a lot better than, when you said we're getting, we're definitely getting yelled at, I was like, uh oh, somebody just pulled up in a truck that sounds official. No, I just, I saw him staring at us and then he grabbed You saw him he grabbed his dog and I was protection. like, oh my God. Don't stick the Basenji on us, don't, <laughs> the you know Fido. All right, what do we do? We fish brain or do we Google map? We've kind of been doing a mixture of both on this whole excursion, by the way, guys. We're using Google maps and fish brain to locate spots to fish. And there's us. Mmm. There's the one on the back. No. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's like the ocean. Oh my God. The Mecca. 128 catches logged. What about on Anna Maria? Is there any ponds? Yeah, there is. Remember I sent oh, you? Oh, look. The first one I sent you. That one's not fishable, but it doesn't really look accessible. Yeah, this, this is the juice right here. Oh, Becca and okay. I both just determined the best way to find ponds in Florida is to literally just drive around and look. Yes. Because you get on Fish Brain and Google Maps and you will get lost. Mm -hmm. And just know there's a new pond at every corner 
and we just stumbled upon this one out of the blue. I didn't even see this one on the map. This one's literally like hidden. So we're about to see. This is pond number 10, y'all. We might wrap it up here. Let's see what happens. Oh, no cast netting. Oh, I love this place. And then look at this gorgeous grass. This is like seaweed. This might be the one. Come on, last pond. All right, y'all, I hope you enjoyed this one. Something totally different off the rails. We just came out here to Florida for a quick trip. Wanted to hit some largemouth bass. Wanted to hit up some ponds, do some bank fishing for you guys. We're also doing some stuff out here on the boat, on the kayaks. Don't forget to drop a like for this one and subscribe if you are new to the channel. But had a ton of fun on a speed fishing challenge with Fishing with Becca. Be sure to check her out down in the description, man. And uh, let me know if you want to see more videos like this where we literally just pond hop all day and night and have us a good old fashioned time. What'd you think? About today? Yeah, as far as the ponds went. Absolutely stunning, she says. Yep. <laughs> Anyways, y'all stick around for more. We're gonna catch you on some more Florida videos. Till then, peace. <gasps>